Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Dustin Poirier versus ben Benoit Saint-Denis. Uh, Dustin Poirier, 29 wins, 8 losses, 3-2 and two in his last 5 fights. He's a slight underdog at plus 145, 35 years old, 5'9 with a 73-inch reach. Benoit, 13-1, and one, minus 175 underdog, or favorite, I'm sorry, 28 years old, 5'11 with a 73-inch reach, 2 inches in height for Benoit Saint-Denis. This is an interesting matchup because you have two guys who, like Benoit Saint Denis, has uh, 13 finishes, never been to a decision. He's five and one in the UFC. He's only lost to Elizu Zaleski, where he's an underdog. That guy's a monster. People that don't know, that's a problem. Dustin Poirier again, like I said, 29 wins. Jesus, he has. 20, 22 finishes out of his 29 wins, 15 by TKO or KO, has been finished 6 out of 8 times of his career, and has been submitted 3 times, has been TKO 3 times, he's 21-7-0-1 in the UFC, that's, that's wild, that is wild, he has 14 finishes in the UFC, that's crazy as well, again, but he also has been finished 6 times in the UFC, but he's also fighting killers so how i think about this matchup is benoit saint denis clearly the better straight grappler so strikes landed per minute is 5.49 to 5.53 accuracy is 50 to 52 strikes absorbed per minute is 4.30 to 5.20 defense is 53 to 44 so defensively on the feet benoit saint denis is not great takedown average is 1.36 to 4.55 Accuracy is 36 to 36, so he's not great at getting takedowns either, but does get them. Uh, takedown defense is 63 to 66. Submissions is 1.2 to 1.4 for Denise. Th I mean, Poirier's fought the better competition. That's It can't even be in question. It, j it just can't be in question. Um, on the feet, even though I do think Benoit St. Denis is decent on the feet, he mixes things up decently. Not incredibly, but decently Poirier mixes it up pretty dang well all this is going to matter on a couple of things 30 being 35 being head kick KO'd by Gaethje in his last one where I think I think a lot of that fight had to do with Poirier thinking about that it's going to be a brawl be intense about it not just and just fighting that you can get you caught in it you know that's how it happened in that one um Benoit Saint Denis, I don't think has straight one punch power. Now, again, he did just knock out Matt Frivola, but again, people that don't know this for some reason, when you run towards something, you get caught. It's a lot more force. So even if a guy that doesn't have a lot of power catches the guy coming in, you can do a lot of damage because it's a lot of force going into that body, going into the chin. So. It's hard for me to say Poirier isn't going to be able to be able to get back up off the off the cage or off the mat. It's hard for me to say that he's not going to defend a couple of takedowns. And I think something we need to be honest about is I think Poirier's boxing against the cage is the biggest thing in this fight. I could see Poirier hurting uh, Denise and then swarming him against the cage. He's gonna have to be careful because the takedown is going to be there. But again, as you as as I read to you, accuracy is only thirty six percent for both these guys, and Poirier is not a grappler. Denis is the guy that's been grappling and all these things. Like Moises caught him, uh, not blocking punches. He ended up winning that fight, but still not a good look. And you can't do that when you're fighting the guy like Poirier. Now again, age may be a thing. Um, him being knocked out in his last one might be a thing where he thinks about it a little bit too much. I'm going Dustin Poirier. I, 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 I just think the striking and the boxing combinations, especially against the cage and especially against a guy that does get caught, I like it. I like Poirier. And, you know, not to go to the distance. This fight's not going the distance. I like Poirier. I think he gets the job done. I think he looks good doing it too. I like Dustin Poirier. As always, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you're picking. Peace.